What's up, ladies and gents? It's your boy, Lou Streets, and they told us to expect some Ermac gameplay later this week. Turns out they meant the very next day. Here's the trailer. I just hope he plays like I want him to play. I want him to be dope because he's going to be my main one. All right, Mavado. You have shamed the souls of your ancestors. Which of my ungrateful kin are within you? Mmm. So he know everybody's history because he got their souls. My viewers did confirm to me that that is Mavado, the cameo. What we got here? Fight. Okay. So we got a restand combo already. There's a launcher. Like he got some of his MKX properties as well. Okay. That's almost like a Fujin back two from Mortal Kombat 11. Got a little bit of range though, that normal. I think that's the front throw. That looks like a front throw. You might be many, but I am the one. You are not even Earth Realm's champion. I love his voice. Okay. Anti air right there. I can't tell if he's spinning meter or not. So we gotta move the hose in the suspension. Okay, that's the cameo on the ground from Mavado. We're gonna review all this stuff in a minute. You know, I'm gonna go back and do a slow motion version. You've changed since we first met. We believe for the better. Okay, so he has a teleport as well. That was an awkward usage of cameo. I couldn't really tell what happened on that one. That's his back throw, all right. Oh, Reptile got a new move. Did you guys see that? That was his standing forward, but he actually went invisible on it. So there's, okay, there might be some new moves and some new buffs coming in for characters. That was a new move. We'll revisit that in a second. Okay. Okay, he spins bar for the one that holds him in the air, I believe. I think so. I couldn't tell if he spins bar on the other ones. Let's look at the fatal blow. My boy got the boots with the platforms on them. The soul usage looks really, really cool. Let's see what the fatality looks like. Oh. 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 Turn my boy into a meatball. <laughs> Poor child. Next week? Wow. A week from today. Yeah, today's the night. It comes out in a week. Cameo fatal. Let's rewind it. Let's get another watch right quick. I definitely saw some things I like. We got to break it down in slow mo in a second. Let's watch it one more time again in real time. Reptile had a new move. So I'm, I'm hoping that applies to other characters as well. Which of my ungrateful kin are within you? I'm gonna just listen closely on this one. I ain't gonna talk too much. I wanna see it one more time while I hear everything. Fight. Love that he floats when he walks too. Restand combo into a launch. He spin bar, okay. That actually did cause bar. Movado has extension for a combo with pop-up. Like you got two different types of extensions. One reached out one and one reached up and down. That's just back throw. But well, that's front throw, I mean. You might be many, but I am the one. You are not even Earth Realm's champion. That move was a little weird because I wonder if it's OTG. We're gonna check that out in a second though. I don't know if he spent bar on that one every single time. I gotta pay attention to that too. That's like a defensive cameo call. With some extension. Mavado looks pretty good. You've changed since we first met. We believe for the better. Alright. Air combo into a knockdown. That's 100 percent back throw. He has a teleport, okay. He spent the bar right there for that one to actually hang him in the air. That's pretty cool right there. I like that one. 
Oh, okay. I think I noticed it right there. I'm going to point it out in the slow-mo. I think I just noticed something. Yeah, okay. For them to hang in the air across the bar. If you don't spin the bar, he's going to slam them down. Because he did it during the last Movado combo. Air Mag looks like I want him to look. This is who I wanted to play. This is who I was excited about. And he looks like I anticipated. He looks as good as I wanted him to look. He definitely looks as good as I wanted him to look. Meatball shout. Love Movado's hooks. A little slingshot fatality. I think there would be more hype if you brought the cameo out with the main character at the same time. So Ermac has some really cool qualities, but let's take a look at things in slow-mo. So the first thing I notice is, let's pull back on this. This looks kind of like Fujin's back two from Mortal Kombat 11. Did he spin the bar on this for restand? Yeah, he did spin the bar, so for restand, kind of like Peacemaker's amp shot. And then if we slow back again, it looks like, um, I don't think he spent bar. He didn't spin bar for the restand down bottom. It's, it's possible when he slams downward that he might be spinning the bar. It's hard to tell. Can't tell if it's a green flash or white flash based on the camera, but that might be a bar spent. And then looking at Movado, Movado has the extension for pop-up. Call Movado, he slingshots him right back to you to extend your attack. So we know that Movado has combo extension. And then I think this move right here, this is when you don't spin bar because you're gonna see it later. Because on the other one, when he spins bar, he suspends him in the air on his slam right here. But we're gonna take a look at that again in a second. That's that same move, okay. So that's that same move that he got the restand on. But now it looks that if you don't spin bar, Either he cancels it into a special teleport or it just takes him in the air. It's hard to tell if that's actually a move or not. And then obviously Movado has more extension in the air as well because he pops him back up. So we got two extenders for Movado right here. All right. And then this looks to be the slam again. Now nah, that slam is different than the last one. That slam looks a little bit like different than the last one. Okay. That slam looks different than the last one that has hard knockdown. This looks like a front throw, but it's weird because I think his throw... I mean, I guess that's close enough range. This is his front throw 100% for uh, Cameo. But it almost like he doesn't grab him, like he got a different style of animation. I noticed on his back throw too. It looks like he doesn't fully grab the body and make physical contact, but that was 100% his forward throw. All right. So we got a kick right here. That's a kick in it. That looks like this attack might be a low potentially. It might be a mid or a low. It's kind of hard to tell, but Movado extends on that. So I wonder, is that an on the ground cameo? Like, it doesn't seem like that's one move. It seems like Movado has an OTG cameo. That'd be pretty cool if he, if he can get uh, damage on the ground. And then we have an anti-air right here. Ermac goes into some type of green state. You see that? He turns into a green state and he has an anti-air. So I wonder, is that full invo or is that just a move to counter anti-air attacks? Let's see it one more time. Yeah, that's anti-air and he extends that. It's something about when he turns in this state. I wonder if it's, or even if it's just a, uh, just a damage buff. And so this is what I was talking about right here. You'll notice when he spins bar on this, now the actual soul holds him in the air. When he doesn't spin bar, it just slams him down. He does it later on in the combo with Movado. But you see, spin the bar right here. He spins the bar and the soul suspends you in the air for combo extension. Okay. And then Movado has another cameo call. This looks to be a little more defensive, but it can be used also in the combo because you use it later on. Think like a uh, nether realm beast trap for uh, Aaron Black from Mortal Kombat 11. Same type of concept right here. He puts it on the ground, you step on it, you get electrocuted, combo extension. All right, and then there's the Movado cameo call again in the air. And so this looks to be different than the other property of that slam and he spins a bar on this, I think. I think he spins a bar and he gets a little more damage on the back end. Calls out extra soul, spins a bar, knocks him back, I think. That could be the same move as the one that we seen earlier, but he spins ball on that slam, okay? Okay, so 
This is that same move. So this is that same move where he pops in the air. So what I'm thinking is, if you don't spin the bar, you don't get the restand knockdown and he launches up into a teleport. That's what I'm thinking. I could be wrong about this, but that's what I'm thinking. All right, and then he extends in the air. That looks to be a traditional knockdown combo. I don't think that's a special ender. I think that's just his move set with the soul that actually swings out. So all of his hitboxes are based on souls, which is pretty cool. All right, now this one is tricky. I couldn't tell what this was during the actual live watch. Cause Movado comes out and they swing them into each other. I'm thinking this is a full, a full screen cameo call from Movado. It looks like a grab almost. Yeah, I'm thinking it's a grab because Reptile gets knocked out of Acid Ball. So it's gotta be a full screen grab. So we've seen, I believe, four options from Movado so far. We've seen two air extenders. We've seen the defensive one on the ground. We've seen this throw and we've seen the OTG. So I think we actually seen five cameo calls from Movado. All right, that's just traditional back throw. Even though it looks like back throw doesn't have a hitbox like when he grabs, but this is a back throw because this is the same animation that he used to start the four cameo throw as well. So that's 100% the back throw. All right. <clears throat> this what I tripped off of right here. I think that characters are getting new moves because if you look, that's Reptile standing forward, but he cancels it into invisibility, but he's still in the same spot. So yeah, I think that there are new moves coming or at least some buffs where maybe we get different properties of moves that already exist because this is 100% a new move for Reptile, or at least a change of his old move. He can't do this currently, so this is new patch. All right. Um, What is this move right here? A half screen special cancel. I, th I think that's not a normal button. That's probably a special of some sort, but it reaches half screen, so it comes out his chest. That's a teleport that launches. Did he spin bar on this? Yep, he did spin bar, so he has a teleport that extends. It extends kind of similar to Scorpion when you spin the bar. That's pretty cool. All right, so you see he spent the bar right there. It's suspended him in air. Now watch this. He's going to knock him into Movado, but then same move right here, and he didn't spin the bar, so that time it slams him. So this is the same move to start this combo. It's just when you spin the bar, it hangs him in the air, but then when you don't spin the bar, it just slams him. Same move right there. Same thing, except he didn't spin the bar, okay? Okay, we have... Does Movado have an armored counter? It looks like Movado has an armored counter. Yeah, it looks like Movado has an armor counter call. Uh, so that's six options from Movado we've seen so far. Wow. Movado has a lot of utility. <clears throat> All right, teleport again. That just seems to be a meterless launcher. We've seen that move two or three times in the trailer. So that just seems to be a meterless launcher. One more time. Uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, and he spins the bar for the extension in the air. And then he takes that in the fatal blow. So we see Movado have six different cameo calls, if I'm not mistaken. I think Movado has six cameo calls. And then we see that Ermac has two stylus slams that he can spin bar on. Plus he has a teleport as well. So a lot of utility right here. Ermac looks as good as I wanted him to look. He looks as good as I wanted him to look for the most part. The fatality is pretty cool. The cameo fatality was like, yeah, could have, could have did a little bit more with the with the hooks, but overall pretty good, pretty good. Yeah, and, and then a week from now, they, I think this would be more exciting if you dropped Movado at the same time. I don't, I don't really like the schedule of releasing the cameo a month later, but overall this does look exciting. I'm happy to see what Ermac looks like. He looks pretty dope. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Are you excited about Ermac? Will he bring you back to Mortal Kombat One? I'm looking forward to him for sure.